Gotta admit. Um, but I don't need them yet. Why don't you have a quest? That's that's my problem right now. He, I think he has to. He has a quest. And he hasn't given me it yet. Hmm. Somewhat strange. Hey, you! What do you want? I know a thing or two about forging. Fine. So what? Can you teach me something? So you already know the basics. I can show you how to improve your work. Then you'll be in a position to make better weapons. How does forge a good sword? How many learning points do I have? Twelve. I can't learn any more one in combat right now because this dude's limit is sixty. I'm gonna. I do have a better weapon already, so it doesn't really matter. Hey. No, I'm not gonna do it. Um, Can I use your smithy? I've got a lot to do. We'll only be in each other's way. Just wait until it gets dark. Then Parliff and I will hit the sack and you can work undisturbed. That's a good thing. Could you make a weapon for me? I don't have time for that. Tandor hands out the weapons, I just make them. And Parliff sharpens them. How's work? I forge the weapons for the Castle Knights. Since we've been here, I've been fully occupied making new weapons. And we'll need them too. We'll show these damned orcs how sharp our blades are. Hey, Parliff, make those blades nice and sharp. Orcs are damn tough creatures. Well, okay. Hey, hey you. Hey, how are you? How do you think I'm doing? I spend a whole day at the grindstone sharpening blades. And yesterday, Engo shortened our rations again. If it goes on like this, we're all gonna starve, or we'll all be killed by orcs. Not a pleasant prospect. Yeah, that's actually kind of true. Who is Engor? Engor manages the provisions and shares out the rations. And they get smaller every week. Sure, you can bargain with them, but only for cold, hard cash. And you can't afford that? The most I can get for the lousy pay we collect is a couple of turnips. Hmm. What's up? That damned Angor should hand out more rations. Where can I find this Angor? In the Knight's house. Just go through the open entryway next to the smithy. As I said, he should be having uh, a quest for me. If he doesn't see Maybe this will trigger that quest to appear. I don't know. Hey, Angor. Oh, yeah. You're the one who deals out the rations, or so I've heard. That's right. Why? Should I feed you now, too? If there's anything you want, you'll pay for it. Just like everyone else. Maybe I can help you with your work. Hmm. Sure, why not? I could use some help. So, what needs to be done? Our food supplies are low. Above all, we're almost out of meat. So, if you could get us some meat, raw or cooked, Ham or sausages, that would be much appreciated. How about it? Will you help us? Don't worry, I'll get you some meat. About two dozen chunks of meat would help me feed quite a few hungry mouths. Come back when you have the meat. I need to get back to my work now. Here, I bought you something. Great, you brought enough meat. That'll do for a while. But don't get the idea that I'll give you anything for free now. Okay, that was the quest that I wanted to do. <laughs> I know it's kind of pathetic, but I wanted to don't do it. Didn't know that. Um, let's talk it's to one of our old friends. Although you haven't, no, if you're only watching my videos, you haven't noticed him yet. Where is he? Oh, he's there. Okay. Hello, Milton! Look who has returned. Our hero from the barrier. Good to see you, Milton. You here again? Again. After the barrier collapsed, I entered the monastery of the Magicians of Fire. But once it was clear that the Paladins wanted to come here, my experience and knowledge of the place proved to be quite useful. So they decided then and there to entrust me with the holy mission of providing magical support to this expedition. Do you remember Gorn, Diego, and Lester? 
um, for those guys.